Hey, out there in YouTube land, this is Matt. This is me saying thanks for the 200 subscriptions plus. Uh, thanks to all my subs. Uh, I try and keep up with everybody. And, and, and it's getting hard with this YouTube because I've been in there and there's... This morning I went in there and there's stuff that was there from two days ago that I didn't see yesterday. But I want to just say thanks. I uh, appreciate all the subs and... Uh, Keep them coming. Uh, keep up all the comments. Uh, I didn't know what to do for 200 uh, subs, so I brought you down to the man cave. This is where the magic happens. So the paint either goes on good and it's magic, or it goes in the purple pond. But this is what I have. I have here my paint booth, just made out of some scrap wood. As you can see, the the car sitting in there. I uh, got up all kinds of light, a heater so I can get it heated up because it's usually about 58 degrees down here. It's in the basement. Uh, got my uh, little test board, a uh, little box that I put little pieces and parts in, uh, all my chemicals, paints, gloves. Still need a respirator. I haven't quite got that far. Uh, just all the spray cans. Uh, one tip I do have, this contraption here on the bottom of the shelf, I'll show you what that's for. I do a lot of painting with acrylic. Uh, and if I'm not drying it with a hair dryer, what I'll do is I made it for the stand. Uh, the stand that I made, when it's done, I slide it in there and let the body hang upside down and it does actually help I saw the tip somewhere some guy hangs all these stuff upside down and it makes sense it keeps the dust falls so it keeps the worst of the dust off so I'd say it's probably about 90 percent effective but all I did was just took some pieces and screwed them to the bottom of the shelf and just slide that little bracket in there and it definitely helps uh, this is, by the way, the Corvette I painted yesterday. It's still got some orange peel and just needs to be sanded down and whatnot. Uh, but that that nail polish color is called Charmed, and it's uh, I can't wait to get this one done because it's a beauty. I want to put this one out in the sunshine. But that's what I do when I'm hanging it up there. And you, of course, you can use these spring clamps clamp it on there if you don't have a bracket that'll hold it on uh, when I put windshields in and glass I'll hang the car upside down like that from a shelf in the in the rod shop and it just helps gravity do its job but that's it this is this is the man cave this is where the magic happens now I've got the purple pond the bleach the Drano yeah, a little bit of everything in here airbrushes all my supplies works out pretty good uh, but again that's all I have and just thanks again for the 200 subs and uh, hope to get some more and I'll get some more tips out there sooner or later as soon as I come up with something uh, everybody have a good day and thanks again